A common complaint amongst cinephiles and movie buffs is the lack of advancement for character actors. In 2005, the late Philip Seymour Hoffman got the opportunity to step up. For Hoffman's very first scene, you notice two very important things. His remarkably slimmed down frame, but even more so, that voice. If you've ever heard Hoffman in an interview or more likely in almost any other movie, he has a deep, almost bass-like voice. His embodiment of Capote's unforgettable nasal whine is nothing short of breathtaking. Bennett Miller's understated, steady direction and writer Dan Futterman's intricate, insightful dialogue bring a welcome level of immediacy to an already famous tale. Hoffman is surrounded by fine supporting players like Catherine Keener, Bob Balaban, Chris Cooper, Amy Ryan, Marshall Bell, and Bruce Greenwood. But the breakthrough performance from Clifton Collins Jr. makes his scenes with Hoffman electrifying. It's a fine biographical chapter of a complicated man's life. Would you like to know more about this film? Click on the link below. Feel free to like and subscribe, and follow me on Twitter. Thanks for watching.